All right, so as soon as we walk through the front doors, they have Easter. Shouldn't they have Valentine's Day first and then Easter? <laughs> Valentine's Day comes before Easter. But anyways, so they had a few Easter items set up there, as you can see. And then they had their tiny little section of Valentine's Day items. And I have to say, I was so disappointed. It was the exact same stuff that they had in the exact same spot as they did last year. This is all the same stuff, the pencils, the pens, the sticker, like it's the exact same items that they had last year and the exact same spot. Yeah, so wasn't too impressed with their Valentine's Day selection, that's for sure. That bag was cute. And actually I thought, oh wow, maybe they might redeem themselves on this little vase, but nope. It was the last one left and it had a big crack, big chip in it. So, hmm. Um, but they did have some cute little boxes there, I guess, for gift giving and some cute little Valentine's Day bags. And then they had these little vases too that were actually kind of cute. I like that pink color, but yeah, that is it, you guys. That was all they had for their Valentine's Day items at the Dollar Tree this year. Wow, that was a really, really bad selection. So I decided to go around the store and see what else they had. So at the front, they also had these dishes, which I thought were kind of cool, and these glasses were gorgeous. Oh, and there's a little bit more of the Easter stuff and a couple of Valentine's Day headbands, I guess. <laughs> and yeah, so that was the last of the Valentine's Day stuff. Oh, and then they had a few St. Patrick's Day things on that end cap over there. Oh, and my husband was trying on some gloves, and he actually decided on getting them. He gave the thumbs up, eh? And how about these rollers? I had these when I was a kid. I remember having to go to sleep in them. Oh, that was awful. It was torture, trying to sleep with those rollers in your hair. And then I just decided to check out the, the hair scrunchies, because I did need to get some. So I tried to find some that weren't too bad that I could use, because I did need some new ones. And then I thought I'd go into the kitchenware section, see if there was anything new there. They had some cute little oven mitts. And yeah, that one was cute. And I think it said love is a four-legged word or something like that. Yeah, they were cute with little paw prints on them. Cute little sayings on all the oven mitts. And then just the random stuff that they usually have. Thought I'd check out the dishes, see if there was anything new in that section. They did have all sorts of different cups with different sayings on them. Those were new. Um, some of them I've seen before, but most of them I think were new with some new sayings on there. So some of those are kind of cute. And I did love their dishes. They got some new dishes in and they were just gorgeous. I thought they were so, so pretty. Yeah, I really, really like them. Unfortunately, a lot of them though didn't have, there's only a couple of them that had like matching um, bowls and like the smaller little side plates not too many of them had the the set and these were cool they had some of their summer items out as well so they had those little gnomes and some little frogs ceramic frogs and these were cute the little ceramic mushrooms and some little birdies i thought these were kind of cute to put in your garden so yeah just a few little i guess spring and summer items that they had on an end cap that they were bringing out. So let's cross our fingers that spring is on the way. And I thought I'd check out the candle holders. Oh, they were a little bit early with their Mother's Day. Wow, Mother's Day candle holders. What? Guess that was good. Just thought I'd check to see if there's anything new there. Always love finding some nice candle holders. Pretending to work. Yeah, <laughs> I'm, sure, I'm sure there's a few people that could use that sign or out of office renovation fund <laughs> and I thought this was really cute for a little baby's room a little pink dinosaur and this was cute as a little trinket box that was a donut <laughs> really cute cute little trinkets and ooh la la and just picture frames oh and if you liked uno you'll love dos the new game from uno <laughs> uno dos maybe they'll come out with a three all right, so we are back from the Dollar Tree and I'll just go through everything that I picked up today. Unfortunately, there was hardly anything for Valentine's Day stuff as you saw in the video. So unfortunately, I didn't pick up any Valentine's Day stuff and they were just starting to get in their Easter stuff. I think I'll have to go to Dollarama and see what they have. So I'll do a Dollarama video and show you what they have for Valentine's Day stuff because that was actually a really, really 
poor selection that they had so but anyways let's get started so keep in mind each item because we're in Canada each item is a dollar 25 so first off I got a couple of these beautiful wine glasses that were at the front of the store they're kind of like a, a clear black color I thought they were just gorgeous really really pretty so I picked two of those up and then I picked up a few of these exfoliating facial mitts We've used these before and they're actually really, really good. So we picked a few more of those up. And then I decided to get just some new scrunchies for $1.25. There's three of them, a black, a brown, and a creamy colored one. So we'll try those out, see what they're like. And then I just needed some more plastic wrap and aluminum foil for cooking purposes. Um, yeah, so that's nothing too exciting there. And then for cleaning, these actually work really, really well. Um, instead of spending extra money on the actual Swiffer brand name, these ones, these ones are the dry ones, and they do the job just as well as the Swiffer ones do. So I love picking these up at the Dollar Tree. They're one of my favorite things to get. Same with the wet ones. I did actually get one more package because I do have some of these still left, but I got one more package just in case. And same thing, the wet sweeper cloths, just as good as the Swiffer ones. So why spend the extra money on the Swiffer when you can get these for a dollar or a dollar twenty-five? And then I just needed to pick up some more supplies for our eBay. Um, just basically some bubble envelopes, and they actually had boxes for a dollar twenty-five. Look at these. Actually, not too bad of a size. Kind of a smaller one, which is good for all of the smaller items to ship out. So picked up two of those, and I picked up six of the boxes for shipping. And then, as you saw in the video, my husband was trying on some of these gloves and decided to purchase two of them. And they're the Jersey gloves. I think they're for, I think they're automotive gloves, I think, or hard, oh, it says hardware on it, so not quite sure. Anyways, picked up two of them. Oh, and I guess this would be the cleaning stuff too. I thought these were actually really cool. It's like a magic eraser, but they're just sheets. So you get 16 sheets in here, but it works exactly like a magic eraser. Isn't that cool? So that'll be just great for cleaning items. You know, we have to get in kind of into those little nooks and crannies and stuff like that. And, you know, cleaning different things where you can't really fit the magic eraser into. So that'll actually work out really, really good. I'm glad I found those. So try those out and see what they're like. And then just a few little food items. We bought some gnocchi, two packages of those. Um, just some pink salt, because I think we were running out of that. And then just some pasta sauces. So the Primo, Thick and zesty, the cheese and yeah, cheese flavor, and then I think this is the mushroom and beef in the Catelli Garden Select, and each of those were dollar twenty-five as well. So that is it. Just a smaller little haul today from the Dollar Tree. So stay tuned. I'll be doing a Dollarama one here very shortly as well. See what they have because I'm really excited to see what they have in store for Valentine's Day and Easter. So we'll check that out soon. Otherwise, make sure you hit that subscribe button on your way out. If you're not subscribed already, that would really, really help us and really help the channel. So please, please, please make sure you hit that subscribe button. Um, give this video a like if you liked it. Give it a thumbs up. And also hit that notification bell to be notified of new videos. And check out some of my other videos too. I'll have them posted on the screen right now. And until next time, thank you so much for joining us and we'll see you all later. Bye-bye.